Hi, it is the Human Operating System time. So today I like to share the following with uh, those of you who is uh, really serious and want to really study and get result and do good for yourself and other people. Uh, this is very important and uh, you never see this uh, up to today. Uh, in the west that people explain you this thing okay so the inspirations i want to do this today is because in the past few days uh, there are many discussions uh, with me from our wing chun friends and other chinese martial arts friends around the world on sing chi to tan tian okay Sing Chi to Tan Tian. Okay, so uh, there are many uh, uh, discussions uh, with me, and uh, we have a chats and so forth. And also some friends asking me, so how to present this thing? Well, the issue right now is very serious. Okay. Do we know what we are talking about here? That, that is the questions we need to ask ourselves. Do we know what are we talking about here? Can we do it? What is it? Okay. You know, for past about, say, 70 years or so, we have a tendency to use the Chinese words to make it more mystical, more magical, to sound deep. And what is that for? Well, there's to boost our own self. Because I'm a grandmaster, so I talk about chi. Your chi is not right. My chi is right. Again, that's what I said before. It gets into all kinds of approval games or disapproval games or opinion games. So what is it? Well, what is chi? Well, what is sing chi to tan qian? Is that so difficult? The answer is no. The problem is people never be able to do it. Okay, and then you can get all kinds of uh, playing the uh, uh, disapproval games or the interpretation game, but none know how to lead their student to get there. You look at it, you check it around. This guy will say, that guy chi is not right. This guy will be saying that uh, the other guy is not as good. But what the heck it is? So today, i like to share with you, okay? It doesn't matter you go to Buddha or Lao Tzu. This, what I'm going to share with you, will work. I guarantee you 100%. Why? Because this is something everybody can experience if you got a good teacher who know the topic and uh, who have developed it to, to, to train you. It's just like the guy who, who, who get a, a degree in uh, electrical engineering. It's no big deal if you want to talk about uh, solid states physics. Because they go through it. Okay? So, 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 like in, 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 uh, in, uh, in, in electrical engineering here, you talk about band gap reference, band gap. People will know what is band gap. Okay? So let's go for it. So today, i like to open this up for you all, for all the Wing Chuners who like to really study. This is not a lineage stuff. This is not a style stuff. This is to get to the bottom line of the uh, educations. Otherwise, we are sitting down there like idiot. Really, it's like idiot. Because we all know the name of the game is to use mysterious, magical word to boost our, our, our title or, or whatever. It's empty, okay?
So, qi in Chinese. We need to understand one thing. Okay, Chinese is not English. Chinese is not French. Chinese is not German. Chinese is not uh, 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 Indonesian language. When we study something, we need to understand what is it. We cannot just go take it as a, oh, you know, uh, I read this uh, Chinese article and then I use a Western mind to, 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 to interpret that. Thing. You don't, you cannot do that. Chinese is a culture that they're using the same word for multi meanings. So when people talk about qi, Chinese talk about qi, there are two types of qi. One is called qi, writing this way. Another one is writing this way. Okay. This qi is breathing. This qi is your body energy. Okay, to make it really first order. Okay, when you talk about qi in human, qi in human. Okay, so long, don't let's get into this. Tao is uh, uh, all the spiritual or whatever heck. Okay, drop those things. Okay, talk about something we can get it. We we know it. We can we can experience it because you and me are human. What's the point to talk about some nonsense which is a nun can show you what it is? Okay, so for human. Qi, in one side is called breathing, another side is called energy, your body energy. So, how do you feel this energy? Well, if you get sick, you feel that you don't have energy. If you uh, have good rest and uh, you really uh, went to vacations, you know, and uh, you feel happy, then you have a lot of energy. Everybody can feel that, right? That is Qi. Don't, don't put it into something kind of magical, BS, okay? If you have a good sleep, good food, and uh, uh, happy, and have no worry, and you have, you, you have a high energy, okay? And, but if you are, that means your chi is strong, but when you are weak and sick, that is you have a weak chi, weak energy. That's what it is, okay? So chi is just like that, okay? Now, so, Let's go deeper to understand what the heck going on with the human body on this, this thing. So we be able to develop it. We know what the heck it is. We we be able to develop it because this is about us human. It's not talk about some kind of uh, 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 beings or ET. Okay. If it is a martial art, disregard of what what style whatever from China, it always. It is within the boundary of the six core element. So the first core element is your physical body. The second core element is your mind. The third core element is your breathing. The fourth core element is your chi. The fifth is your force handling. The sixth is your momentum. Okay? So you have the six core element. This is called six core element. So I categorize this after decades of works. Okay, I coined this term six core element. Okay. You might find that well, I, I, I speak here like I'm egoistic. No, I'm just taking responsibility on that because there are other people who copy my stuff and do not follow that. When it's come to six core element, you follow this. Otherwise, thing will get screwed. Okay. So the third core element, the breathing, is qi. If you talk about uh, the Chinese, will mention qi. The fourth core element is qi. Okay. Now, this four core element. If we want to be more scientific or get into the scientific language, language of us today in the West, the first thing is oxygen. 
the oxygen handling, okay, your oxygen in your body, that is cheap, okay, because the oxygen have to do with your body, uh, your, your body energy, scientifically, okay. The second thing, it deal with your diet, because energy come from your food. If you don't eat, you don't have chi. You're dead. Okay. The third thing, it deal with ANS, your autonomic nervous systems. So in other words, is what the Chinese say it is chi. Okay, or the chi core element. We in the West right away think okay, this is about oxygen. This is about the diet. This is about our. Uh, autonomic nervous system which is the parasympathetic and the sympathetic nervous system so in this core element the chi core element is handling that okay or it's belong to that area okay so the first four core element the the physical body the mind the breathing the chi that is a common platform for martial art and for the healing for qigong and for everything in this aspect okay the qigong for healing qigong for strengthened body uh, it is this four core element and then when you have uh, the this is four core element and then when you have uh, the martial art then you add the force handling and then the momentum okay momentum which is the soul of the martial arts. If you don't have the momentum, you have only this four core element and this force handling. You don't have a martial art. Sorry to say that. It's just a recreations or uh, a, a kinds of exercise or, or body uh, for health, uh, for uh, for for different type of uh, 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 exercise or sport for those kind of stuff. But if you want to go martial art, you have to have momentum handling. Okay. So this is how it is. Okay, you need to understand this. Now, so what what is a sing chi to tan tian? So we go very far here to talk about chi. And then we want to ask, so what is it? So what is it? Sing Chi to Tan Dian. Okay. In a very simple way, and a very uh, uh, focused way, and a proper way to say, Sing Chi to Tan Dian simply mean get into the balance states of the body, mind and energy. The balance states of body and mind and energy. That's all, okay? It is not focused on certain part of your body. Sing Chi of uh, to Tan Tian, what is it? It is just to put yourself into a balanced state of mind, body, and energy. That's all. And if you want to look, look at the four core elements, it is put your body, mind, breathing, Chi, into a balanced state. Okay? So why do you need to go to balanced states? You want to go to balanced states because you want to the body to run effectively and you want to optimize the use of body, mind and energy. Or your four core elements. Okay. So what is that? What is Sing Chi to Tan Tian? That's just to put you into a, a, a balanced state. A natural balanced state. Okay, now I want to let you know. Very important term. Natural resonance states. Okay? You put yourself into a natural resonance states. So your 
four core element is in a natural resonant state okay a balanced state and why because you want the body the mind the breathing the chi to naturally balance itself effectively run and optimize itself that is the reason of the the sing chi to dan tian okay now sing chi to dan tian is not like i have to pay attention to my lower abdomen those kind of thing Th those are not the thing you can keep pay attention to anything you want and you end up will get tunnel visions and you're going to end up going to uh, screw up your body why because your body mind energy or your four core element all have two different states okay so there's two states one is called intentionally intentional regulating or control another one is natural resonance so when you sing chi to dan tian you actually want to put your body into this natural resonance states not messing around or screwing around with your mind oh i visualize this light i all this kind of thing those are bullshit those, those create problem because your mind doesn't know your body your sifu have no idea of your body so how the hell is he going to say oh you know what you just uh, sing uh, uh, pay attention to your 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 uh, your uh, navel area three inch under your navel there's dan tian and you can get internal up that's completely bullshit those type of style female do not touch it because it's going to mess around with your periods and if you have a uh, uh, you you you're pregnant it's going to mess around with your with with your uh, uh, blood circulation and everything in the area okay so so sing chi to dan tian is about balance is about right natural resonant state in western we have a, a, a term called let go let god that is what it is okay the chinese doesn't live in a different uh, planet we all live in the same planet be it in the west in the east we are human okay now now you know what and why so don't screw up okay don't 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 use those kinds of uh, visualization you know i have the secret way of uh, sinking chi to dan tian forget about it that create more damage when i was young i'm like you guys too will believe in those bullshit and it turns out the, the 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 more i dig out the more i see the teacher the more i see this is problematic and the more i get scream and yell and scold by my by my sifus okay in the past 100 years there are many uh myth or magic for marketing purpose spread around spread around the chinese traditional martial art community it's nonsense though, though those people don't even know what they are doing okay so so do i know what i'm doing sure i'm going to show you how today start from today on okay you check everybody using medical western medical biomarker i'm going to show you at the end okay so let's end this bullshit in the Wing Chun, okay? Now, how to get there? How to get the Sing Chi to Dan Tian? How to get the balance? In other words, you know, let's stop using the term Sing Chi to Dan Tian because why do we want to use some term which you have no idea? Just talk about this balancing. So how to do this to put your body into the balanced states, okay? Which means something. For us not sing chi to dan tian huh what is that how to put the body into the balance states 
you know, the, the ancient Chinese would say, Xing Qi de Dan Tian, but today we don't want to use that term. I'm a Chinese descendant. I love Chinese uh, 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 culture. But I say, don't use it anymore. Why? Because what is the point to screw everybody uh, 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 using a term which is nobody understands what it is? And nobody can do it. When I say nobody, sure, one hour, one, one million probably you will do it. <coughs> one million. <coughs> so it is, even if you want to be really scientific, it is close to zero people can do it. One hour, one million. Okay. So the way how you want to do it is this. Remember this is a four core element. Okay, so you have six core, which is for the martial arts, and then you have four core, which is for your human, okay, uh, human mind body energy development. So this is physical body, this is mind, this is breathing, this is autonomic nervous system, plus your oxygen, plus your diet energy, okay. Now. In order to get your body into the balanced state and the uh, optimal state or the effective states or effective state to, and op, uh, to optimizing it, we need to work first on the physical body. As the other day I said that the seven bowls, the seven bowls of the body, you know, you have a, a, a person here standing here. Okay, so your, your bowl, your seven bowl here. Where I can find the thing. Yeah, over here. So the seven bowls here, this is from this book if you have one. The seven bowls have to be in the proper, you have to put it into a natural resonant state. You don't hold it there like like a like, like a rack. You want to put into the natural resonance state. So it be able to run effectively. Okay, because we know that there is a, a, a intentionally control or a regulating state, then there's another one which is right natural resonance state. You want to put your body in the natural resonance state. And often people cannot train it standing. They need to train it like laying down. Okay? You have to do that. And then, the mind has to quiet down. Quiet down. Okay, quiet down doesn't mean that, well, I visualize there's a light come from the lower abdomen. I have the line going running through this. No. Quiet down, meaning you stop, you drop your mind. So you don't think. Human is more than thinking. Okay. If you can do that, your mind will quiet down here. Your mind will quiet down. When your mind is quiet down, because your body is loose, your mind is quiet down, your breathing will be calm, deep and long naturally that is the breathing part okay <coughs> those who know how to do it just stand there get their body into the natural resonance state quiet down their mind mind quiet the breathing automatically going deep okay breathing going deep natural resonance because the body have a, re a, a, a natural resonance everybody is different and uh, it just it just pick up the, the, the timing in any meditations serious meditation like the Buddhist Anapanasati is all do that any advanced qigong has to do that. So the qigong always saying that, loosen the body, uh, 
this is the quiet in mind and natural in breathing. And natural in breathing is come from your body is loose and your, uh, your, 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 your mind is quiet. It's not that you have no idea on this uh, uh, body and, uh, and, and breathing, uh, sorry, body and mind, and then you jump right away into the breathing. Count five, inhale, <clears throat> and then you stop breathing for five count, and then you exhale for five count. Those are intention regulating or intentionally controlled. Those are not going to get you into the, the, uh, the, 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 the natural resonance state. So there's a lot of people who spend decades but still have no idea on their two state, intentional regulating and the natural resonance. And thus there's no way, it's hopeless to, 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 to be qi, sing qi to tan tian or get balance in the body. One can keep advertise whatever heck they want, but they never get there. How is, how is the body going to uh, get to the natural balance itself, run effectively and heal the body? It can. Okay? So a lot of qigong is really doesn't work. But the ancient Chinese descriptions and the training and the, uh, the, 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 the essence of the technology. Okay? So get it serious there. Now, when you get into this, this, uh, this state of the, when the breathing is get, going deep and so forth, one thing will surface. And this, what, what surface is, you will start to get saliva, water mouth. And that is the first indications of that you enter into the, the chi layer. Because that saliva is, you are actually activating your parasympathetic nervous system. You calm down, you calm down. And that is the beginning of your chi layer naturally get into the state of the natural resonance. Okay? So, you want to talk about Xin Chi to Tan Tian? Really? Serious? If you cannot get through one of those to up there to the, 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 the uh, get the breathing uh, uh, naturally handle and uh, have the rhythm, you know, natural resonance, and then the, the saliva come out and all kinds of stuff from this chi stuff, okay? Then after the saliva, somebody will feel that oh, there's a warm and then all this uh, uh, energy, energy channel line is, uh, is flow different way. And remember, Different people and different condition, even with the same people, it will not be the same. Daily practice. Okay? Because it's natural resonance. It, the body is an intelligent, very smart uh, uh, machine. It it be able to to to, uh, to 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 balance itself as soon as you let it, you have it to balance itself. Okay? So meaning you you, you put it under a, a condition. What you can do is put the body mind energy into a good condition so you let the body mind energy do its job so say the shooting how uh 1850s queen quit the fifth quit say okay meeting in the Tantian. well if you look at the first quit is that is is handling the physical in the equal so does that is handling the mind, call back. The first stanza is called call back. Your, uh, your, your, your mind or yourself in the ego, stand, uh, ego so does that mean that your body is loose, your mind is quiet down. And the last, it, it say that sing chi, okay, a meeting in Dan Tian, okay, and then they do meridians and so forth, so forth. So what does that mean? It means that you put yourself into a balanced state and your do meridian, uh, meridians, okay, uh, which is your, your, your do channels, your, your energy channels, activating when this is proper. Okay, it is not like, oh, you know what, the, 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 I want to focus on my Tantian and then I feel heat 
and then I just uh, I just uh, 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 use this heat to circulate my uh, my my up down my spine. Forget about this. You read the Chinese uh, research; those type of uh, so called micro micro orbit stuff cause strokes in China in research. For past almost uh, 1950s until today, almost uh, 80, 80, uh, 60, 70 years already, people have those things. Okay? So it's not, not those kind of uh, uh, cosmic stuff and so forth. So when people ask, somebody say, oh, you know, pay attention here, pay attention to that. Is when the teacher coaching a student and say, oh, this guy always uh, lost his attention in the lower abdomen, for example. He said, oh, pay attention to your abdomen. Then the teacher look at the guy. Oh, he already paid attention to his, uh, his, uh, his lower abdomen. Then he said, okay, now you want to drop that thinking. You drop it. Oh, because that is just try to balance, balance, help the student to balance the body and leave it alone. Okay, so all the means of this, or oh, pay attention to here and there and there is for different people at different conditions. It is a mean of intention regulating so that to help that person enter into the natural rational end state. Got it? So Sing Chi the Dan Tian is about natural rational end state, is balancing, enter into that state. It's not using your mind to thinking something that's called intentionally regulating. That is called creating damaging if you don't know what you're doing. And even if you know what you're doing, you don't not going to do it long time. Because as soon as you're using your intention and not quiet down your mind, you're in a dissipative mode. And you can create tunnel vision. Okay, and hallucination too. So this is how to get inside that. Okay? This is how to get inside that. Now, you know, I cannot pull everybody uh, like you cannot, you cannot push a push a baby to. You cannot eat for the baby. The mommy can put the food in front of the uh, the mouth, the baby's mouth, but the, the 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 baby has to eat his own food. What I tell you here about four core elements is in this book. So you know what. I make it a ebook version which is zero dollar in Amazon if you're a prime member zero dollar but still nobody I shouldn't say nobody but really really extremely rare people go and just care for to read that book and and found out all this thing what I found out is this what I found out is people come to my channel took uh, certain of what I'm, what, what I'm talking about like yesterday somebody talked about I talked about the Shilin Tao and everything and they said well you know I'm going to uh, uh, use uh, the, the put the breathing into my Shilin Tao set you know oh my god in that in that video I tell everybody do not mess around with your sets you need to know what it is and this guy said you know I just want to put my uh, I, I want to put my breathing into your, uh, the, your, the breathing you say into my sets. People are just seeing something they want to see and then just use it. Disregard of I, what I'm my intention of sharing the video. So, I was discussing this few days. So maybe I need to make this video channel a pay channel here on. High price pay channel. Otherwise, nobody is going to take me serious okay because it's free so it's a, it, it is a, it is a, it, it is a worth nothing no value and people don't take uh, uh, me serious so maybe I have to go back to the like the ancient China again you go come bow to me uh, 3,000 times pay me three thousand dollars to be my student before I reveal a little bit a little bit here and there for you you want me to do that I can do that. I can. I can do that. I release this thing, is because. You have so many wing chuners. Who you have people who's burnt out. You have people who's sick. If they don't know this. 
You want them to keep in paying money every month for nonsense and it's not going to help in their health? Not helping their martial either. Living in a fantasy zone called internal art. Okay? So that's why I say I have no style, no, no, uh, no lineages. It's for education. It's time for us to, 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 really, to really know what we are talking about. Otherwise, what are we doing? Living the fantasy so that all the, uh, the, 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 the mainstream scientists love the hell out of you? No. So how, how do I verify? I say so many things already. How do I verify? How do I verify? Well, we can verify with what we call today biomarker. Like in medicine, Western medicine, biomarker. You mark that thing and you know exactly what you're looking at. And the biomarker I have suggested to everybody is the heart rate profile. The heart rate profile. You look at the heart rate profile right away, you know if that person be able to do sing chi to tan tian or balancing his body, energy, and the mind. Am I serious? Sure. You want to take a sing chi to tan tian? This is heart rate profile. You will be able to at will going into the natural resonance state okay so the heart rate will drop and then this is the the sing chi to tan tian state okay and then this you can do something else you see that within minutes it's going down there and it stay there this is heart rate drop When one practice, okay, so when one practice and getting tired, one be able to slowly drop the heart rate. That means one be able to handle the body, the physical, the mind, the breathing, because that is actually related to the heart rate and it related to what? Your autonomy nervous system, which is your, in this case, you drop your heart rate, meaning that you be able to evoke or to make, uh, to make the uh, parasympathetic nervous system more heavy in weight versus the uh, sympathetic nervous system when you use intention trying to control something. Okay? So, Don't believe me, get the biomarker, check it. You can, if you can do that, you can go to any lab, any hospital. You just drop it. Get yourself into the natural resonance. Sing Chi to Tan Tian, right? So, if we have no idea on the, the body, get into the natural resonance, the, uh, the, the, the mind, quiet down, the, uh, the, the breathing, it naturally go to deep and so forth. What the heck are we talking about? The Sing Chi to Tan Tian. Okay. For Chinese, for Buddhism, for Taoism, mind and breathing. They are couple. If you have thought, you have breathing. When you are breathing, you have thought. They influence each other. And because this influence each other, it influences your nervous system, your autonomic nervous systems. And that influence your chi, your energy. Okay. So this is what I'd like to share with you today. Okay. To really want to know all this stuff and train this stuff, this is like having a PhD in the, in the university. And we should do that. 
because this is technology, human technology. Okay. Why do you want to live in the fantasy Gaga land? Always about Sing Chi to Dan Tian, but no one know what the heck is going on. No one be able to at will enter into the state if they if they uh, want to. Why do we want the, the, the mainstream sci scientists to, to love the hell out of us? Why do we want to keep explain this in with the spiritual religion? Why don't we just go train it and then develop it and then you get into the state. Let your body rest. Help your body. And only that, after that, you know that you experience that you'll be able to teach others. So, so you say, well, you ask me about question. I say, well, this is my heart rate profile. Didn't I show you the heart rate profile? I'm no grandmaster, but I know this technology. It's like I know how to design power chips. You don't BS me on system, circuit, and devices. Okay? Engineering, technology way. And that's fair for everybody. Why? Always think about, don't think about all this high uh, 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 virtue or moral. Always just think about your, your, your student is like uh, your customer. They pay for what they buy. You give them the product which is meeting the specifications which is you promise them. That's all. Okay? Don't talk about high moral. If we can do that, the world will be the world in the traditional Chinese market will be in much better shape than today. You know, you look at the in China, the MMA guys say put in the public is nonsense chi. You go to Taiwan, the same where people say, well, it's nonsense chi. You look at the MMA people. Okay, they're Chinese, they're Chinese descendants, they say the same thing. And then you say, no, 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 you know, uh, uh, our ancestor, the Chinese ancestor is, uh, is uh, knowing their style. You, you, don't, you don't know what you're talking about. Well, stop that. So that's why I'm using a biomarker now. It doesn't matter your Western medicine uh, uh, doctor or whoever. Scientific is scientific. It's for the people, of the people, by the people. So this is for you today. Okay. Again, I cannot eat for you. I can only keep telling you things. You know, put the books out the Amazon for zero dollar. But if you don't want to, to, to study, to, to get serious on it, and you're thinking that only if you pay a, a million dollars to me that uh, you, you, you get the real deal, then well, that's your problem. I cannot help you.